He lived at the Chicago O'Hare Airport completely undetected for three months because of the kindness of strangers and the busyness of the international airport. You are not going to want to miss today's video. Hello and welcome to today's uh, trending weekend news video. I hope this video finds you well. Five days ago, a man by the name of Aditya Singh was arrested at the O'Hare Airport in Chicago. Mr. Singh had come to the United States five years earlier to complete a master's degree out in the state of California. As his time was up and he was ready to return home to his home country of India, after stopping for a layover in Chicago, he said he became afraid to return home to India because of the rising cases of coronavirus. So instead of flying home to India, he slept and hid at the international airport for three months. Not having much food, clothing, or money, Mr. Sting, Mr. Singh stayed in the shadows, politely asked strangers for money and food, and used the bathrooms to freshen up. Now, as far as I can tell, it's not illegal to sleep or stay over at an airport. In fact, in 2006 or so, my wife and I got caught at the Denver airport in one of Colorado's worst blizzards and had to sleep on top of cardboard boxes with tiny little airplane pillows and tiny little airplane blankets. It was not fun and we missed our trip to Mexico. However, international airports have different rules when it comes to people that live outside of the United States. Also, Mr. Singh was caught with a missing security badge, and it is believed that he had been entering uh, secure areas where he did not belong in order to find a place to hide or to sleep. So upon finding that badge, I believe that's what got him in trouble. Now, Tom Hanks played a role in a movie several years back about a man who was stuck at an airport because of war in his home country. So what do you think should happen? Should this man be placed in jail and tried? Or should he be shown compassion because of everything going on right now? Let me know what you think in the comments. Also, have you ever had to sleep at an airport or stay overnight? I'd love to hear your story in the comments. 2020 has been one of the most bizarre years we've ever lived through. And I think living at an airport would only make it that much more bizarre. I hope you enjoyed this uh, weekend video. I wish to remind you that you are amazing. I appreciate you being in my community and I'll see you on the next video.